Judges, Judges 3.15. But when the children of Israel cried to the Lord, the Lord raised up for them a deliverer, Ehud, the son of Gera, the Benjaminite, a left-handed man. The children of Israel sent tribute by him to Egog, king of Moab. You know, when we seek the Lord, he'll rise us up, but he may surprise us to who he rises up to role of leadership because God still brings leaders in today even though we have one on one relationship with him Second Corinthians For when we were come into Macedonia, our flesh had no rest, they were tired, but we were troubled on every side, outside, or fightings inside were fierce. So this explains why they were unrest they were not able to they were concerned about the surroundings it wasn't a lack of faith in god because they were there it was just the flesh you know they weren't being disobedient but they did have concern about what was happening they were troubled they were stirred up to where they couldn't get proper rest you know oftentimes we can't rest in the middle of the storm of life as much as the peace. They had peace in God, but they also knew that this was a very strong situation. Verse 6. Nevertheless, God that comf comforts those who were cast down comforted us by the coming of Titus. So he brought comfort to them. They give credit to God for bringing them this comfort. They acknowledge it was God and Titus was brought to them to help this. Um, so they go to the Lord and he responds and gives them what they need. And not by coming only, by his coming only, but by the consolation wherewith he was comforted in us. When he told us your earnest desire, your mourning, your fervent mind towards me, so that I rejoice more. So Titus let them know how Corinth was reacting to the Lord, uh, to the Lord and to Paul. How they were mourning, how they desired to see him, how they hated the fact that he was going through this, how they prayed for him. How they were striving to listen to him. You know, they just went through a hard time. Now Paul's receiving this blessing about hearing of Corinth from Titus and being blessed with Titus' presence. You know, oftentimes in the storm, in the hard times, God has something blessed on the other side. We just got to follow and trust in him to get to it. <laughs> 